So, EA just dropped the mid-season two review pack. It contains one guaranteed player from World Cup Path to Glory, Road to the World Cup, or World Cup Stories, plus 14 rare gold players. All items are untradeable. This could be a sick pack. For cheap, fast, and reliable foot coins, check out MMOEXP. There is a link down below, and use the code HABER to get yourself 5% off all of your orders. All right. Let's see what we get. Obviously, that you could get like a Path to Glory in Kunku or Griezmann or uh, Gomez, for example. You could get a uh, Road to the World Cup. Who was good? Son, Modric. Or you could get like a World Cup Stories Rashford or something like that. Any Man United player would be awesome. Here we go. 75k or 1,500 FIFA points. And my player is a, is, a, is a gold walkout. That's not good, is it? Well, it's 90 rated Neuer. So maybe, luckily, potentially... Um, like this could this could be a good thing if if Neuer's on the front then maybe like oh I don't know it's it's gonna be like Oviedo Osorio oh no please please surprise me with something good here <laughs> we got ourselves Shkahiri and Neuer I mean Neuer's ninety rated I'll take that that's not actually that bad. But that is a terrible, terrible special card in my pack. Okay, well, let's go open up some more. Hopefully, they're better than that because that was absolutely rubbish. All right, well, he, uh, he opened it whilst I was joining the party. That's not ideal. Uh, but he gets himself Mertens. Is that good? Probably not, right? I mean, the card doesn't look horrendous. But at the same time, like, for 75k, I'm pretty sure the card's worth about 35. So, that's unfortunate. But it is what it is. All right, next... Mid-season review pack. This one we get to watch the whole animation for. Apologies. Um, that was my fault. I wasn't real. I wasn't paying attention when I joined the party. All right, here we go. Seventy-five thousand coins. Uh oh. Ruben Dish. All right. So what I'm realizing, by the way, so it's seventy-five k. We need to just try and make seventy-five k back. Ruben Dish is probably about what twenty, thirty k, maybe thirty k. So that's half the pack back almost already. Ah, well, two walkouts. Chesney's probably what, like 15, 45k. Oviedo's got like what, 10k value as a as a 85, 55k. It's about 20k loss. Big L. All right, next one. He's doing it with FIFA points. Here is the test. Are FIFA points better than coins? Hello, walkout. Oh, oh, Lukaku. No, is that? I don't know if that's good or not. 88 Lukaku. I. Uh... I have no idea. Let's have a look. At least it's like a, a, a walkout player. It's an L. <laughs> it's 26k. If the lengthy metal was still a thing, he'd probably be worth way more. But unfortunately, unfortunately, he's only 26k. But it is what it is. You know, at least... No, there's no at least. All right, we've got my boy James or Stotty's pack next. 1.5k FIFA points. We want to see walkouts here, EA. Come on. As in, like, walkout special cards. Not walkout, not normal walkouts. I, that was my fault, wasn't it? Not even Lewandowski. 86, Chesney. I don't think there's any good players that could come out of this behind a normal gold, right? Asmoon. Oh, brilliant. Okay, well, EA are clearly on the scam hype right now. This is definitely one of those scam packs, isn't it? We've got both the Winter Warmer pack and the uh, new mid-season pack on this account. We'll do the Winter Warmer pack first. These packs, in my opinion, are some of the best value packs in the game. They're not like... I've not seen anyone get super insane pulls from them, but they're all tradable. And for 500 thief points for like 20 rare golds, it's not bad. It's honestly not a bad little return. Like For a fiver... Um, I, I think they are like one of the best packs in the game, to be fair. I, I think they're really, really good. Um, I, you know, I like them a lot, but it's one of those ways, like, it, it depends if you think FIFA points are actually worth buying or not. I, I'm not against purchasing FIFA points. I don't think, like, it's a super smart thing to do, but at the same time, it's like, you know, I buy, I buy skins on other games and stuff like that. Do you know what I mean? So, like, I don't sit there and judge that. So, it's up to you what you do with your money at the end of the day. Anyway, um, let's go. We have our mid-season two preview pack. Here we go. Sort us out. Sort us out, EA. Oh, no. I don't see the lights going up. Asmoon! Get out of my packs, Asmoon! We battered you 6 2, mate. Oh, EA. They're all rubbish Path to Glories as well. Where are the, where are the other cards at, you know? All right. 75,204 coins. He's doing it on his RTG. I feel guilty. I'm going to have to do it on my RTG now as well, aren't I? Hey, we have a road to the World Cup. Germany. Striker. Oh! That's not bad. Timo Werner. I feel like, is that good? Uh, like, it was when it came out, right? Um, Is that, 
78k profit let's go big w's we made 3k 3,000 coins but he's untradeable but you know what i mean big w it's actually a pretty cool card as well because the last person just opened it on their rtg with all their coins i feel like it's only fair i do the same i'm gonna do my winter warm-up pack and my uh mid-season two uh pack mid-season review two pack with coins on my rtg account as well here we go with my winter recruits pack it is terrible not a good start at all it is tradable mind but that is not a good start at all uh it's untradable i opened the wrong pack oh it's the other one that's tradable isn't it it's the uh oh no it's the winter recruits pack i'm so stupid i might oh i might have to sell something and do that to be honest i'm so dumb I'm so dumb. I thought it was this one that was tradable, but it was the, the 37.5k one that was tradable. Ooh, Roberto Carlos ain't a bad one to get, though. That's not bad. Um, sadly, that pack was awful, though. My bad. Okay, well, we do have 84k left. Let's, let's open it and see what we get. Here we go. Come on, EA, sort us out. Come on. We, can we get something good? Oh, walk out path to glory. Somebody said to me that th this card is legitimately one of the best cards they've ever used. It was on the last Irate or Teams episode. Um, He's 27k. He was up at like 100k at one point. He went up to 91k. I thought I'd just got a W. I mean, this card isn't terrible. Four star, five star. <coughs> Incredible stats, to be fair. However, not ideal, is it? Big L. 27k. Ouch. Not ideal at all. But I feel like he'll get game time. So it's not the end of the world, to be honest. We've got my mod Ewan or Sim Sweeno's pack next. Who apparently has the best pack look ever. Man's got untradeable 91. Dino, Janola, World Cup Lucio. Oh, Winter World Sword Stories. Okay, it's, it's not great, sadly. Um, But it's our first Stories card. Which is not bad at all. We take that. It's our first Stories card. However... Not ideal, is it? Not a great pull to get. Trent in there as well, though. So a walkout and a stories card is okay. Sadly, very unlikely gets game time because obviously he is he plays for the World Cup League and Japan Nation. Um, so not ideal, but it's okay. All right, next one. Mid-season two review pack. We've had one World Cup stories and like two Road to the World Cup so far out of like, I want to say 10 of these packs or something, 12 of these packs. I'll have to figure it out. Um... Can we continue? All right. World Cup. Path to Glory. Danish. CDM. Um, Delaney. No, not ideal. Did they even get out of the group? I don't think Denmark made out of their group, did they? I don't remember. How have I already forgot that? Hopefully, there's walkouts behind that. Oh, Kovacic. No, there's not. It's sadly just Delaney. It's not a terrible looking card, to be fair. I feel like he'd still do a job, but... I think most people have got better cards now at DM anyway, so that's tough. My boy Cridian's pack now. Let's go. Come on. Our fever points better. Here we go. Here we go. Yes, stories card. Go on, Rashford. Who is this? Yeah. I can't lie. These packs seem like such a scam. Such an absolute scam. Um, that card, 80... Uh, do you know what? Uh, no, I'm not even... I do this all the time. I try and see the positives and be like, yeah, you know what? This card would actually probably do a job. But I know, you, like, I know Cridian is not happy with Kier, nor would anybody. And the market is also broken. Okay, brilliant. Not ideal at all. Come on, EA. Please. Can we get something insane? Please. Please. Can we finally get, like, a Rashford or a Bruno or something? Or a Vinny Jr. Or a Griezmann or an Nkunku. Germany. Right mid. Nabry. Yeah, cool. Germany got grouped, mate. Germany got grouped in this World Cup. So Nabry didn't get any upgrades. If that was like a 89 rated card, if they got to like the semis or something, we'd be happy, but it's not. All right, we've got Gassetti's pack to end it off. Pack numero 15. Um, let's run it. Here we go. Can we end it off with something good? Please, EA. Please. Here we go. It is a team that... Oh! Oh! Oh, it's Guerrero. So what that means, basically, is uh, he got a team of the tournament as one of his... Gold players. So there is a Path to Glory, World Cup Story, or Road to the World Cup behind that. The only problem is, is that Guerrero is 85 rated. And he pops up behind um, normal walkouts. So that the other card is 85 as well. To be honest, that's the only problem. But, 
It's our first double special card pack. Yeah, Shkiri. But it's our first double special card pack, so I can't complain too much. But at the same time, fast out. If you guys have enjoyed the video, please leave a like down below. Subscribe if you're new around here. And I'll see you lads later.